Question three in this um, worksheet is, if it takes 50 mil of, oh, we're neutralizing again, we're gonna go with potassium hydroxide this time, reacting that with sulfuric acid. We're gonna form K2SO4 as our salt and water. Now this needs to be balanced and put states in there. I'll put the states in first because they're really easy. And then I'm gonna balance it up. I need it two in front of my um, potassium hydroxide. Um, that's gonna give me two hydrogens, another four, so that's gonna be two there. So that's my balanced equation. Main thing I know is it's the ratio of hydroxide to acidic hydrogen. There should be two hydroxides for every um, two hydrogens here. So for every hydroxide, there should be acidic hydrogen. There was two acidic hydrogens, so therefore we should have a two here. So straight away, even without writing a full equation, I should be able to see this ratio. Anyway, let's move on to what's in the question. And what have I got? I've got the fact that I've got 50 mils of potassium hydroxide. And that's gonna be 0.5 molar. And our sulfuric acid here is gonna be 125 mil and I'm not gonna know my concentration. And that's what we need to find out. So to do that, again, following the same steps, I work out my number of moles of the thing that I actually have, which is gonna be C times V, which is gonna be 0 0.5 times 0 0.05, which again, I'll go into my calculator and go 0 0.5 times 0 0.05. Uh, where am I at 0.05? Is 0 0.025 mole. That's gonna be equal to, oh no it's not, what I need to do is I need to ratio here. Look at this, it's a two to one ratio. So for every two moles of this, I end up needing one mole of my sulfuric acid. So therefore, my number of moles of sulfuric acid is gonna be equal to my number of moles of KOH divided by two. So therefore, it's gonna be 0 0.025 divided by two. Uh, I can do this in my head. But anyway, 0.0125. So that's my number of moles of my sulfuric acid. And then I simply just, again, put it into working out my concentration. That equals N over V, which equals 0.0125 divided by my volume, which is gonna be 0.125. And that should be um, 10 by the looks of it. Uh, and it is, Point 0.1, what am I doing? All right, it's 0 0.1, why did I say 10? I have no idea. Oh yeah, because I got it around the other way. But anyway, that's my concentration of sulfuric acid. In each of these questions, what we're doing is we are determining the number of moles of something we know and ratioing it to find the number of moles of what we don't know and then doing whatever the question asks us to do. That's the fundamentals of titrations. So we always find the number of moles of something in an equation and then ratio it to the other reactant.